Hi everyone, I'm Sophie from Mirath, Lebanon. So at Mirath, uh, we've been working with uh, churches in Lebanon and in Syria since the beginning of the war, uh, the war in Syria, uh, helping provide uh, humanitarian assistance to people who have been affected by the war, uh, whether within Syria or, or in Lebanon. And over the years, we've uh, been able to understand better how conflict uh, impacts hunger and the main thing is that it does so because it both deprives people of their assets and income and livelihoods uh, while at the same time making most basic necessities uh, either inaccessible or more and more expensive or both. So conflict uh, usually obviously has very negative impact on the economy of a country and employment uh, raises uh, and people are left uh, with no income. And so in countries, in third world countries, where usually there's no social safety nets, it's, it's really catastrophic for people uh, not to have an income anymore. The second thing is that uh, war and conflict uh, cause many damage to people's property and assets uh, and forces many to flee, uh, leaving everything behind. Uh, and live as either refugees or internally displaced. And they're in, usually in new places where they have little to no connections uh, or working opportunity. And the third thing is that the prices of all basic necessities usually increase um, because when the economy is affected, the local production usually is as well uh, and the local currency usually plunges. Uh, which means that uh, the, the people need to import more, but importing now costs more money. And it's even more true for uh, people of countries who are under international sanctions, like Syria, uh, because it becomes even more difficult 